Hey, Terra Nation. I'm back. Do a bit of angle. I'm so tall. Um, I'm just going to start out just doing a collective reading. A short one. I'm just going to um, let this bed play out. So I can cleanse our cards. The sage is like one of the most difficult bunches I've had, right? But it's good, it's gonna last me like forever. Forever. It's like not as bad as when you get sage that's loose. And it just like catches on fire and you can't get it out. <laughs> had some troubles with sage, I tell you. Okay. He's done a layer reading before, so I'm gonna move some stuff around. Um, so for this reading, I haven't really seen much about from my me. You should bear with me. I hope it doesn't fall. How's that? Can see a little bit, right? Okay. Spirit, I ask you to cleanse these cards, cleanse this space, um, freely um, channel messages through me as a vessel for our collective and our messages that we need to get through quickly is today. I mean, and yeah, see, oh, um, a quick sip of my tea. I'm doing a video right now. I'm doing a video. I'm doing a video right now. <laughs> now I have to edit it. Now I have to edit it. Teenagers, when they want your attention, right? Oh my gosh, do you have children? Okay. I probably should edit that. I don't know. I don't really like editing. I like, um, character. <laughs> I like it to be interesting. I kind of like it um, when I'm listening to readings and my little bit of drama goes on and there's like a dog or a cat and the cat just comes and lies all over the cards and like the reader's like, okay, well, <laughs> plus plus feels <laughs> like you're really going to start surrendering. <laughs> no. we'll see. This will be a nice reading, a nice good little laugh. All right, they're just jumping out right now. I wasn't even sure if I was ready for them, but. Oh, and on the floor. Holy moly. Okay. <clears throat> what do we have here? Our first card we have is the surfer. So uh, the Man of Cups, this card um, is about <sighs> surfing that, um, well, we're just going with the flow, really, of the roller coaster of life with those waves, with emotions, mostly, is about, um, what's that word? Oh, man. Um, like, controlling our emotions, that's not the word I was looking for, but, um, yeah, having control of our emotions, um. Just riding out those big steep, steep hills, steep waves. Hold your breath. Hold that space. Um, try not to take it out on anybody. Try not to project it everywhere. If you need to tell people some truth, maybe wait. <laughs> wait a little minute until you're not like. Argh! Anyway, so um, yeah. See, you're going through some quite emotional things at the moment, and um, I feel like you're also aware of this and um you know that there's no really way around it like you can't um you can't repress it you can't drink it away you can't smoke it away you can't like it's gonna be there we know this we're grown you know we're, we're adults so just try to ride those waves out and um everything is temporary everything everything's temporary today's temporary tomorrow's temporary how you feel today's temporary Feel tomorrow doesn't. Everything can completely change tomorrow, you know? 
No, I said that. I'm like, oh gosh. <laughs> All right. Master. A master card. Master card. Don't get a master card. <laughs> Do they even have those anymore? I don't know. Um, Sage of Worlds. Mastering, mastering our gifts, mastering our talents, mastering ourselves, mastering self-control, mastering positive mindset, um, all the epic things that help you manifest in life, like, you know, this is what you're working on, you're working on not just figuring it out, being aware of it, knowing the process and your steps and what to do is mastering it, once you've mastered it, you get to move on to the next thing and you can master that. I like mastering things. But also we have um, setbacks. We have little bumps in the road. So um, don't don't take that to heart. Like n you don't get amazing things. You don't just get given them. Like we know this. We've got to work hard for them. We've got to surrender. We've got to do all the things. Um, next card we have is the guardian. Is that woman? Woman of crystals? Um, the guardian card. Um, you're very protected. You are seen. You are heard. Your prayers are at the moment. Um, they're in the process. So they have been heard. It's not an instant manifestation. Because you know we all know instant manifestations are they're short lasting. You don't want something you know like stable and secure and something it means a lot to you in your life to happen instantly like they need time to build so um while you are building those and looking after yourself and staying in that positive frequency in your own frequency you you have a guardian you have angels on your side you have everything on your side right now so just <clears throat> no you still can't see my table so Okay, we're literally balancing here. Yeah, you still can't see my cards. <laughs> but you'll see the next one down here. Um, then we've got the strength card, Leo. Um, sometimes the road is so long and so hard and the hurdles, and we're like, how the hell? How the hell? And it isn't until we fall into the depths of how, how do we keep going? How do we get more energy? How do we get more strength? How do we see past this? Um, it comes. We ask for it. We pray for it. We work for it. We surrender for it. We love for it. Love is huge. Um, there's so much strength in love. So if you can go get some love. Get some love. And I mean like real love though. Like don't hurt yourself. Don't hurt yourself, try to substitute love. Be strong. You got this. Devil's play. Um, where there is light, there is darkness, right? Um, there would be no light without the dark. There would be nothing. Um, might have some haters, might have some, um, some tests, some entities, some um, some evil eye being passed your way, some jealous, some envy, some, ugh, I don't know, exes. Um, and that doesn't just mean ex-boyfriends or ex-girlfriends, can be friends, family, can be, you know, um, they see you shining and they hate and I can't believe I just saying that. <laughs> uh, um, but just keep shining because you're, you're you're protected and you owe them nothing. They, you know, um, they're just barriers. Like, they're just um, there to stop you from getting everything that you goddamn well deserve. And they can't stop you for long because they're too strong. Otherwise, why would they wouldn't? People don't mess with people who aren't, that don't have something they don't want, you know, that they aren't envious of because... I'm not saying anyone's better than anybody else. It's not the direction I'm going. It's not who I am. Um, but just keep striving through. Ignore that. I ignore a lot of stuff. I don't hear a lot of stuff. When I need to, stuff catches up to me and I will literally hear it. It comes straight to me. Um, but by then, I'm gone. 
you know, I, I don't muck around waiting to see if people are going to step up. I don't muck around waiting to see if they're going to um, fix the trust that they broke, if they're going <coughs> to, excuse me, like become better people, treat me better or anything. I just leave. I just go. I just work on myself and I just keep going and keep shining brighter like, oh, well, that didn't work. You know, just keep going through and you will find amazing people on the way. People who align with you, people who have the same wants and needs as you. You're always going to attract people who don't want to do anything and they just want you to carry them. But um, you get more aware of this and you see it and you stop it and you're like, nah, I come way too far for you. <laughs> no. Success. Our Man of Worlds cards. Like, this is your... Success um, looks different to everybody. It comes in all different forms, like um, big blessings, small blessings, goals achieved, lists with things crossed off, um, unexpected, you know, unexpected things, blessings, um, tests. We don't even realize our tests until, you know, we've completed them. And, um, you know, we don't usually know that they're tests also until we've actually accomplished them. Like we can go through a test over and over and over again and not know it's a test because we're failing. We're not failing, but we're just not quite learning the lesson yet. So, um, learning lessons, mastering, you're very protected, you've got the strength, yeah, you've got people chasing you, but phew, they can't catch you. Can't catch you. I'd like um, one more card, I think. Oh, actually, I don't really... I shouldn't have tried to control that, see? Like one card. Mm -hmm. Mm. Um, messages. Do we have anything anything left um, ongoing for our collective reading today? Like have we I'd like some some leaving guidance, something um, they can take on this journey, like a checkpoint. Um, can we open a new door in this moment? Can we just, you know, put our foot in there and hinge that door? Like, actually, yeah, I think it's time. It looks like you're ready. That door's open. Maybe you just got to step in it. Maybe the door's right in front of you already and you don't even know. Like, are you sulking? Are you tired? Are you looking around? Are you standing in the sun and recharging? You been out with nature? done something fun lately like we get too comfortable we're not going to change you, know, you gotta open your mind open your eyes go out and do something if you're looking for answers if you're looking for the doors just go find it i feel like going for a walk now <laughs> okay we got some more cards here all right we've got the regenerator card um Sage of Cups. Um, it's really important when you're on quests and you're missioning and you've got your foot in all these different doors and you've got goals and you're working really hard to look after yourself, to uh, drink water, to eat good food, to stretch, to exercise, to work your brain, to make sure you know you have self love, um, you are giving love. Regeneration um, is just rebuilding our energy because it takes a lot out of us and we've got to keep that balance of it coming in and out and um, making sure that where we're putting our energy is balanced. Equal give and take. <clears throat> moon card. Um, the moon card is... Um, hidden things coming out um, maybe you've just been kind of a little bit um tunnel vision like just goals 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 you know um control and order and security and um you might not be seeing um some things around you that you need to open your eyes to or someone's possibly going to come and talk to you about something um something you're not aware of something um you've probably not seeing at the moment because you're distracted by um, your focus. Um, if it doesn't align with, with what you're doing and where you're going and who you are, don't worry about it. 
just um, keep your boundaries. Um, um, but yeah, definitely going to be getting some information coming to you soon. Mm. We have equilibrium, equilibrium, the two of cups, which um, two of cups is like a, it's a union, it's a, um, a coming together. It's the love card really, but it's it's not two. Because it could be um, friendship, it could be reconnection with family, it can be, um, you know, making a new friend, it can be um, connecting to the networks, building a network. It's really like a joining, a joining, uh, maybe making a team. Um, or, you know, it could be, for some of you who resonate, it could be a relationship um, going to a next level. Um, maybe people being more open about their feelings with you, about their intentions, speaking. Um, and then we have trust. Six of wands, that's quite hard to read backwards. So, um, the trust card is having faith, having faith, um, Right at the end of our manifestations, um, I know there's there's a there's a quite a quite a testing point there, where you kind of can get into the self doubt and lose um, yourself a little. You kind of lose the idea because it's taking too long or it doesn't look like it's going to work out, and um, disbelief and self doubt. If you keep telling yourself something's not going to happen, it's it's going to find it really hard to happen, right? If you're just, when you're the creator and you create things up here, it comes, you know, it starts here, this is where we plant our seeds. If you're planting seeds that something is not going to happen, it is not going to happen because you're creating it not to happen. So make sure you trust yourself, you trust your intuition, you trust spirit, and you trust Trust those that you know, those that you're on the same page, you're on the same level. Um, just trust in yourself, mostly, and like believe in your manifestations. Um, and if you are on right on the edge, on that point of self-doubt and feeling like you've pushed so far and you've tried so hard in something, um, those are the moments we need to hold space. Hold space in those moments where you've tested the most. Um, so if you need to rearrange your mind into um, positive and belief again, now is a really good time to um, to maybe write down some affirmations to um, just really pull your head in on what you're trying to do, on what you're trying to create, on who you're trying to be, and just um, believe. Have faith, be in the love frequency, surrender, and um, try to do something nice, something fun, something you enjoy, and just be in the moment for a bit, and you know, that last step of manifestation is letting go, um, what is meant to be for us, if we're receptive to it, will be for us eventually. There's no time because the time is fluid. <laughs> Just like numbers. Okay. Um, I feel like I'm just going to look up the trust um, card for a minute. Six of wands. And I'm just going to um, read it because I feel like there's an important message in here. Light is symbolic of trust. In light we trust. We follow the light. The red candle lights are wands that symbolize eternal blood loyalty, your trust and family. The circle of hands symbolizes the human community and the greater community of all life. 
Recognizing that we are all family, trust others and be loyal. Like the child, see the goodness in others and be trusting. Like the adult, holding the child, be responsible and trustworthy. Enter into friendships, partnerships, marriages, alliances, agreements and contracts that you honour. That your higher self honours. Trust the universe exemplified by the parachutists and God's hand holding the ring of life which supports the acrobats to make more sense if I was holding a card in my hand right because you could see the image mm -hmm. know that the universe never gives you anything you cannot handle you are supported reach out above all trust yourself Symbolized by the collapsed hands together. So, <clears throat> hold your space and love, love yourself, and get ready because um, everything's about to change. So embrace this moment right now. Thanks for watching. <laughs> I hope this is helpful. I hope my energy was good. Bye guys.